He does the uh, voice of the um, uh, that guard down there. Uh, the, the, the ones that go, he makes a go quest to disarm those bombs in the um, Black Sun sector, I want to say. He's there. Uh, he's also the uh, bounty hunter who's tagging Sith apprentices in um, Droman Kos. He's, uh, he wants you to uh, either tag the, uh, to stop the Sith from tagging people or tag his accuser. Whichever one you want to do. Light side points, obviously, is for um, killing the, or tagging the apprentices, and dark side points is to just kill the accuser. Either way, whatever works um, best for you. So, yeah, he's been, in a, he's been there for a few times in Star Wars The Old Republic, at least in the first couple chapters. I don't know if he's in any of the, um, it doesn't ring any bells in the uh, later expansions, but. Yeah, I've heard him before. I want to say he also does the voice of Bato in Ghost in the Cell Stand on Clone Complex, but I could be stretching that a bit. The anime, the American dub, or the English dub of the uh, Ghost in the Shell Standalone Complex. All right, let's go take on these clowns. Try to get this last piece of the puzzle solved so we can um, move on to the next area. We are with you, yeah. Where, where are you going with me? Where are you? Let's do it. Oh, that's right. This is a new area. Those people disappear because they're all dead. Here he is. This land festers. We must cauterize the wound. It's funny that those two are both good people of the light and they fall to the darkness trample our enemies leave nothing but ash what? the relentless pursuit of victory that's it that's all you have to do all right now i have to fight this guy he's a traitor so the mortal returns along with our wayward baron the constructs failed to finish you, and so did the Maul. How disappointing. Your schemes have brought about your own ruin. Now we will end you. Foolish Mograine. Always valuing loyalty over might. Well, they go hand in hand. Victory lies in one's choice of allies. And with their help... I now claim the mantle of Margrave. I will bury my blade in your skull, traitor! Do oh, it! Crixus! I bested Crixus himself! You two are nothing! We will avenge him! Here! You cannot win, Viraz! You are outnumbered! <laughs> Fool! All the houses of Maldraxxus stand against you! <laughs> Enough games. Gods, slaughter these weaklings. Honorless coward. Ashbringer, more walkers. With me. Wait, I want to loot that seat of the Primus is under siege. We must defend it. What about that guy? All right, never mind. Hmm. Just uh, let him go to his own devices, whatever. Blood and 
In my pants. We'll hold the line. Open the door. All right, opening the door. Where are we supposed to stand here? Well, all oh, right here. Here? Yeah. No. Slay the mortal. Bring me that rune blade. Not gonna happen, loser. That looks pretty cool. Get him! The feet of the Primus is ours! I need my buddy with me! The seat of the Primus is ours. Sanctuary. Oh, it's right there. Wait, how'd she get inside? For the honor of the blade sworn. Cool. So what's this? A ruin stone? I am the Primus. Your presence within my sanctum means a darkness has fallen upon Maldraxxus and all the realms of death. Ages ago, the Eternal Ones punished our brother Zoval for his treachery. He was bound within the inescapable maw to be forevermore its Jailer. Now I fear that Zoval did not act alone. I suspect he had ancient allies and will seek to win others to his cause. That you are hearing this message means my suspicions prove true. Zoval has forged his chains into a weapon and brought about my defeat. Mm. There is but one hope to save the Shadowlands. The Eternal Ones must stand together once more before the Jailer escapes the Maw. Hmm. Bring my warning to the Archon, the Winter Queen, and the Sire. They must see to our defenses. Do not let Zoval reach the Sepulchre. Cool. The Arbiter is the final key. Protect her, or all is lost. I see. The Primus was basically one of the main people that ruled over this region, I guess, and then he was betrayed and murdered. So now it's up to everybody else to bring everybody together. How goes the fight? In the name of the Eternal Ones, the Jailer. This is a dire message. Return to Oribos. Inform them that Maldraxxus will not strike at the other realms again. Our war lies within. Hmm. Yep. Sucks, but oh well. That's how it is over here in Maldraxxus. So now Maldraxxus is all done. Everybody is, I guess, somewhat under control. The chosen ones, I guess, rule this realm. They're under control. Of this area. 
So now, we head over to the next area. I think. All of these have been battle tested. I thirst for combat. Me too. I'm thirsty for combat. Mmm, delicious, delicious combat. Accept nothing but me. Don't mince words. Dismiss. Dismiss. Yay, that area's done. <laughs> Just go back to Ogre Meyer and get flying mount speed. Might as well, right? Even though we're just there like a few minutes ago. Get another talent too. Uh, what's this? Fifty times? Wow. Huh. <laughs> 6.66 .66 chance! Yeah! That's awesome! I want that one! Yeah! That's... Yeah, we gotta get that. Definitely gotta get that. It's gonna scare everybody away now. Oh my god, that guy's got 666 six, six everywhere. What? It's just a number. Doesn't mean jack all. Alright. I'm not going to talk to these clowns just yet. We are going back to Ogremeyer. We're going to learn how to fly. Even though it doesn't really pertain to anything that we're doing right now. Because we can't fly anywhere else. They won't let you fly any any location. Do you? Then we're going to go to the, the uh, Night Elf area. That place is cool. Flying doesn't cost too much like back in the day. Back in the day, it took a lot of cash. Oh, well. My brain also went on, hey, you know what we should do? We should play uh, at some point in the future World of Warcraft Classic like it was back on, back 20 years ago or 15 years ago or whatever when Wrath of the Lich King came out. Play Classic instead for a while. I'm like, eh, it has potential. Although Classic was kind of slow like I understand why people want to play that game because oh I remember all the fun Warcraft used to be now it's all everything it's like do they go beyond um, Wrath of the Lich King because I think Cataclysm is where things just started picking up a lot faster and that was where the game to me changed for the better a little bit more fast paced a little bit more uh do more stuff. The only issue is the um, a lot of this, a lot of these assets that they made aren't worth squat anymore. Yeah, now we can fly. Not fast, but better than what it used to be. When you got the first flying option uh, in World of Warcraft, you had sixty percent speed. And it sucked. You were moving slower on in air than you did on land. Now they fixed it so it's a little bit more balanced. To me, it makes more sense. Like, why would you fly slower? But, all right, whatever. Words of the Primus. Back to Orbors. All right, so we found the ones on the left, a little bit on the right. Now we're going to do the other one. Technically, nightmares should fly too, but I don't think they're considered a flying mount. But that would be so awesome if they were. Uh, it kind of sucks that they, you can't fly in some of these areas. You have to learn something or do a quest chain or go do dungeons. Like I'm not wasting my time. The Arbiter sees all things. To do that stuff, you know. The Eternal City must endure. 
All right, back over here now. Please, Father. Oh. We need to know if our friends can still be saved. Oh, snap. I not understand the risk, Talia. For me to peer into the mall would mean... Oh, that's right. all the way to the realms of death to meet the father I thought was lost to me. Volvar Fordragon, one of Azeroth's bravest heroes. I haven't asked a single thing of you since I was a little girl. The little girl you sent away. But I'm asking you this. Tell us if they are still alive. My shining star. I will do as you request. Okay. So, if you remember all the lore of World of Warcraft or not... Bolvar sacrificed himself to become the Lich King so that after Arthas died, um, which he was a defender at the Wrathgate, which is a whole storyline that you do in Dragon... I think it's Dragonflight in um, uh, the Northrends back in the day. And... Yeah, Dragonblight. So there was a quest to the Wrathgate. It would be this area right here on the northeast side of the map. You did that, the Wrathgate, and he sacri he died there and was burned alive and poisoned by the um, the whole the undead that kind of broke off and there was this whole storyline that gets cut off now. You can't do that anymore, which sucks, but it was it was probably the coolest uh, storyline to do in Dragon in Dragon Light back in the day, and um, so he's dead. He becomes the Lich King after um, the Battle of the Lich of the the Frozen Throne, I guess. And Arthas dies. He becomes the Lich King because he's basically the way he looks now is what he was in that scene. And he they, he takes the crown, becomes the Lich King, and Talia. Uh, What's the situation? is the his his daughter and she was living over in um oh where <sighs> no over in call terrace and she's in the trigad sound she helps you out over there for the most part all the quests at least a good chunk of the quest lines over there which is it's a i, li I don't know, i like the alliance's quest over here on call terrace the ones in zandalar really really suck i think um but that's why we didn't do those. We decided to do Shadowlands anyways, because it's what latest one any, and I don't really, like I said, I don't care for some of the areas. North Run would be the, the other area I would have done if we had to go back in time, but, you know, we just decided to do these over again, so they're pretty much the same quest line. All right, show me what happened. Broken Helm still resonates with the power of the Lich King. Power of the Maw. The Maw. All right, this is what happened. <laughs> wow. Okay. I could make out the Lord Admiral's voice and what must have been Thrall's as well. Their cries. Oh, they chilled me to the bone. If you say so. I did not hear Anduin nor Bane Bloodhoof. Hi, Lord. 
Are you certain you cannot try again? Not yet, Kalia. There is a price to be paid for such visions. I dare not attempt another so soon. Okay. Do it! High Lord, this mortal bears an urgent warning from the Primus of Maldraxxus. They must see it delivered to the other realms. Please aid them, honored voice, while I talk with the others. We must consider the implications of what we've seen. Wow. That mage is just going off on everybody. Oh. We stand together cool. against the darkness. No, not the purple one. All right. Speak, mortal. I will consider your words. Sure. All right, let's get the heck out of here. To Ardenweld, wield wild Willy Wonka in the chocolate factory. Oh, we gotta go upstairs anyway. I'm out of range. Open it. <laughs> Ooh, bluish purple. All right, here we go. The purpose. This is the way. I need to watch those this weekend somehow. Watch uh, Mandalorian season three. I haven't seen a single episode. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. All right, here we are. It's basically pretty cool. It's one of the better places. This will be a prank to remember. Just oh, hello there. What hello there. Can I do for you. The message is magically sealed. Well, that's no fun. I know, right? Night Lily. Uh oh. That's you being dead. <laughs> Featherlight, you place the lily. This stupid seal just won't open. <laughs> Will that be all? Say hi. Wake up. Will my slumber recedes. Oh, that's supposed to be funny, huh? A beard, a hat. Chips of time and murk of hay. Who's what? This way, come along. Sadly, the Winter Queen cannot grant you an audience. What? Her spirit is spread thin across Ardenweald. Okay. This drought threatens the entire forest. Your voice is but one bird singing in the night. Okay. The queen's magic protects every branch, every leaf. If not for her vigilance, all might be lost. All right, this one, this place is really for weird. Now, we night they must act in her stead. Help! Help me! Yeah, I'm good. I warned you not to come back. Oh, okay then. That's Sorry. racist. I have to make a quick stop on the way. What fun you're about to have. Featherlight will guide you from here. Help the forest as you head for Tir Naval.
Come on. Do something stupid. I dare ya. Got you. You be dead. Always so much to do. What's this? <laughs> yeah, I'm never gonna use that. As you were, Corinth is always getting into trouble. Let's see what it is this time. Yeah. Okay. On to the next area. I like, I, I said the right side of the tree is pretty sweet. The left side of the tree just sucks. In pretty much every class. Except for the paladin. Paladin's different. Featherlight. Over here. What's up? I'm sorry. Are you a mortal? No. A friend of Featherlight is a friend of mine. Ah, uh, pass. Now. Light embrace you. I am quite busy, you know. Try to coax the bird away from the nest. <laughs> Just gotta do these stupid spells, huh? Check out my swinging moves, yeah! Look at that! Keep it up. I'll just sneak past. Check out my spins! Woo! Does that turn you on? I'll kill him. Don't worry, I got this. Mine now. Should have stayed alive. You wouldn't attack me. It's all your fault, Corin. Loser. And what is it you require? All right, you have my attention. Follow me. Hartwood Grove isn't far. Each wild seed holds a spirit of nature who will one day awaken and return to their world. Reincarnation, huh? The queen must decide which ones survive and which wither away. The spirit within... Featherlight, we be in need of help. Okay. Welcome to Arden. Dang it. Look for refuge. This way. We were attacked by starving wildlife. There are souls in danger. No, no, not the souls that are in danger. I swore an oath to care for those wild seeds. We can't just abandon them. Yes, we can. This place is slowly, slowly going to heck. Tizan, you found help. No. Have you come to help? Please save those poor souls. Okay. I'll try, but murder time happens first, you know.
Dinky. There we go. Safe, safe. Here on your head. How about new? No.